Hey friends, welcome to the channel. It's nice to see you back again. Welcome and thank you for joining. If you are a subscriber already, thank you very much for that support. If you come across the video because of the algorithm and YouTube searches, that's great. I'm glad that you found the video. So today I'm going to be talking a little bit more about the Bucart A10 Anniversary Edition bookshelf speakers, which I have in home have had for a number of days throughout this week. I've listened to them a number of times. Um, a little bit about the system because they are self-powered bookshelf speakers. I do have them running through a Rotel preamp. This is the 1590 Mark II. DAC is handling the uh, signal that is being sent from the Rotel CD11 tribute edition and I also have a Weem Pro Plus streamer that I use for streaming Kobas and Spotify and other streaming platforms. Since the speakers are self-powered, they are receiving an XLR cable from the preamp and then they are set to zero on the dial, so no 6 dB gain, no 6 dB drop so far. And I'm playing them off of whichever tuning was installed when I had them shipped to me. I am borrowing them. I didn't pay for them. I'm not being paid for the reviews. They are in my possession through an understanding with Mads Bucard himself for an opportunity just for me to listen to them and knowing that I do talk about what I listen to in my space. So it sort of works like free advertising, but it's not necessarily a review or for review purposes. It's more for my personal use and I'm gonna tell you about what I'm experiencing as I experience it. Let's get a better look at them, shall we? So these are made of a natural wood, real wood, um, thick panels of wood as well. They're very, very, very stout. You can see across the top of the cabinet, the front of the cabinet has got these layers of wood that you can see there. Uh, it's fully open cell grain. You can see the panels there, the different colors. So that's the way it's assembled. They are hand assembled in Denmark. So it's a Denmark made speaker. Some of the components may be sourced from elsewhere, but the main engineering and assembly is done in Denmark. So they are a special version. In terms of the library of, of Bucard Audio, Bacard Audio has a number of speakers already. Uh, P300s, uh, S, I think the S400 Mark II, S400s, S300s. Uh, I'm not all that familiar with all the products. However, this one is different. It's different not only in that it's made in Denmark completely, but also using a Purify woofer. Now, I know a lot of people don't know what's going on with this surround. A lot of people think it's broken or it's ripped or it's damaged because it doesn't look like these. We're used to seeing these surrounds where they're just circular uh, or half, half tubular and instead this one has got ripples and it goes in and out behind the cone so some of it is downturned, some of it is sticking out. Now the idea, if you're not f familiar with Purify Audio, the drivers are made that way so that the linear motion of the cone is stabilized by the surround in both its minimum X-Max and its outwards X-Max. So its plus and minus is controlled by that surround in two directions. The ridges is not a new technology. As you can see here, I will show you with my trusty example that I have. There are other brands that have used ridges to, to stabilize the surrounds to make sure that motion moves in one direction. So these ridges have the benefit of controlling the woofer movement while also allowing for a little bit more excursion. It helps with rigidity and it helps with linearity. The Purify drivers bring that to another level by making sure that the motion is in two directions at once. So the idea of the Purify woofer and the master tuning that's possible with the powered speaker means that these speakers can be controlled additionally with DSP and processing in your space. So the same way that you would for studio monitors, 
these speakers have the amplifier built in and they are wireless enabled, WISA, so W-I-S-A is a different wireless protocol. And they also have a USB input where you can use what they call master tunings or DSP tunings to change things like the, the EQing at minimum, perhaps even crossover, whatever the crossover looks like, however that looks in a space, maybe even some phase control depending on where you're listening to them. If you're listening to them in near field, far field, close to a wall, certain things like that. Again, I'm not completely up to par on the technology itself, but I do know that it does change the sound profile or character while the drivers are still capable, the internal DSP can control some of the aspects depending on how you're using them. So in my use case, and enough about the details, in my use case, my room is fairly small. It's somewhat treated. Um, it's perhaps more over damp than it needs to be. Uh, I like a rather dead sound but I do have my diffusion on my first reflection points as well as some of them on the ceiling so I'm creating a width and a height by controlling my room's dynamics I really appreciate what these sound like they're very smooth I think they have even more more detail or textured retrieval it's not that they're brighter or higher resolution in terms of high frequency extension but the quality of the the quality of the frequencies that I'm hearing through these is actually a step above what I'm used to hearing. Now I've had the SVS in the house for a long time, as we know. These are a ported speaker with a six and a half inch driver, uh, time aligned, uh, angled baffle. In the other room, I have my Arundel towers. Those are also ported. Uh, my all, almost all of my other speakers that I've listened to are all ported designs. These are sealed designs using the DSP. It's a little bit different. Uh, the sealed designs have always got different sorts of characteristics. And pairing with the subs, which I haven't completed the integration yet, it's mainly just the speaker itself at this point. All the output that I've listened to is on its own. Today I'm listening with the subs just to get a feel for where the crossover should be. And then there's further things that I can do with them. They also come with a wireless base, which you can connect, a uh, connect your digital sources to, HDMI, and it will project the WISA signal to the bookshelves. And then you can assign a left and right based on the configuration on the amplifier. Now, I haven't done that yet. I probably will at some point. I'm curious about it. Uh, as is, I believe, because we're, we're the inputs are XLR analog, which goes into the DSP, which means it's going from analog to digital and then back to analog through the amplifier. So it's two conversions. The wireless transmission would just be digital to analog through the inside. So there's a potential there for it to sound different. Um, I have to demo, I have to test that out. Someone in my comment sections was asking about that exact thing. Uh, sorry about that. I'm just going to change that song. And yeah, so I am curious about the wireless capabilities, whether it's going to sound different or how different or what those things may look like. Um, in the meantime, yeah, I'm getting used to the way they sound. Um, experimenting, listening to songs that I know, this song in particular I've used for sound demo. So how about I just shut up for a minute, I'll turn up the sound, and we'll use the last part of this video as a sound demo, yes?
quite brilliant, I must say. So I'm going to dial it back at that point. Hopefully that was enjoyable. Yes, a lot of people have asked me what the CD is. This is TDF Retail Therapy. When you look this album up, please uh, enjoy the names and the artists listed on the album. It's quite a surprise. I'm very glad and fortunate I still have this actual CD playing through the CD player. Um, because I've had it for many, many years. I've had it since the 90s. And for whatever reason, and I'm glad that it doesn't flag the copyright gods, I've been able to use it for my sound demos and I will continue to use for my CD source. Um, anyhow, I will keep this one relatively short. We're at about 12 and a half minutes here and I probably will only have to do one edit. Um, I had to turn off my phone there so I went quiet so unfortunately yeah, I'll have to edit that one part out <laughs> you'll notice there's a skip in a previous uh, section in the song um, yes without further ado that'll be the wrap up for this again if you just discovered the channel thank you very much for clicking on the video uh, I don't know what the thumbnail is going to be as of yet I will have to edit and make that one but this has been the Bucard audio a10s a10 anniversary edition bookshelves made in denmark made of real wood using a purified driver new um, aluminum dome tweeter i believe the previous versions were soft dome quite an amazing experience so far i have a lot more to learn about them a lot more to evaluate wireless system i will figure out what the crossover points are for the subwoofers but yeah it's been a lot of fun so far so thank you very much to Bucard for sending these to me I'm honored and privileged to be borrowing such an amazing set of speakers just to hear what Purify is all about to understand the technology there are about 10 other proper reviews of these out there you can search for those on YouTube if you want to know more information in that regard Check the website for all the details as I'm not really giving you any details. So want to more or less just give you a little bit of extra, a little bit of experience of them and maybe something that wasn't mentioned on other videos. Anyways, any comments, please leave them in the comments section. If I have earned, earned your subscription today, that's awesome. If not, check back and maybe see if I do better for that subscription. Uh, anyhow, I'll see you in the future. Please take care of yourselves. Listen to quality music. Treat yourself well. Be uh, kind to people. Spend time with your loved ones. Uh, respect the priorities of your life. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you very much.